What's going on everybody? My name's Brian and welcome to a video that I'm normally not going to do that often. Uh, honestly, I usually do gameplay footage so something like this is very rare but I just wanted to do this video because I've been looking on the internet and I haven't found the best or easiest solution. I'm going to show you my solution or at least my way on how I go about recording some person's audio on Skype and then play a game at the same time where I'm hearing his voice, the game audio's voice, and as well as the gaming captures capturing my voice at the same time. And I'll show you a preview of that at the end of the video. So let's just go right here. I have OBS right now open. What you want to do is open the game that you want to go. So right now I have Star Wars Battlefront open down here. I as well have my Skype account down over here. So what you want to do is open the game first. So get to the game you want to launch. Right now I'm just sitting in the menu you could see right there. So you want to open Skype. Now I want to show you some little details what I do with Skype. And what I normally do is go to call. And I'm going to go to audio settings. Make sure you have the microphone that you're going to use to uh, capture your audio as well as what your friends are going to hear. So right now I have the Blue Yeti equipped. So just go to whichever microphone you're going to use as well as the speakers so you can see speakers here you normally I would have my headset but right now I don't have my headset plugged in now the audio the volume audio for your speakers are kinda key because what I kinda notice is how OBS treats uh, the Skype's like volume of your friends or whoever you're talking to kinda matches up with the game audio a little too much it's kinda like synced together so what I normally do is I go on the volume bar and I like to go a little bit more than halfway. You can see it's a little past halfway. So like, you know, right around here is where I like it. Not too high where it's going to hurt your own ears when you're talking to them live while you're recording, but not too low where the game audio is going to over, like, let's say overwrite your friend's voice and you're not going to be really able to hear your friend's voice. So I like to have it a little bit here, just a little bit half past halfway. So once this is all done, you're going to save. And now you're going to go to, you know, whoever you're going to call. You're going to call them up. Right now, I have nobody on Skype right now. So you're going to just leave that alone. Once you go into, make sure your game is up, running, everything's all good. Okay, so here we go. We're on OBS right now. Ignore the monitor capture. That's what I'm using right now to record this video. So what you're going to do, this is going to be blank. The sources are going to be blank. So you're going to make sure the scenes is, uh, you have a scene. And all you do is right click, and you're going to go to add scenes. And you're just going to name it and then click OK. That's all you're going to do. So that's really easy. I also make sure that your settings are all good on OBS. Um, you have to figure out what's the best, you know, what's the best for settings for you. Everybody's a little different. Each video I do might have to tweak it a little bit. So make sure you do all that and fix all that. OK, so now you're going to go to Sources. Here, here's where it begins. You're going to right click on Sources. You're going to go to Add. You want to go to Game Capture. We're gonna have the game. So right now, I'm gonna name it Star. Whoops, Wars. There we go. Okay. So now right here, we're gonna go in in game capture. We have select application. We're gonna go to Star Wars Battlefront. Make sure that is the game or whichever game you're gonna do. That should be a list. So you're gonna go to there and click OK. So once Star Wars is there, if you actually go and click Preview Stream, it's going to show the Star Wars, it's going to show this on the bottom left corner right here, this right over here, it's going to show that on this display in the middle. So once that's all done, you're going to also what you're going to do is you're going to right click again, go to Add, go to Game Capture another time, and I'm going to do Skype, I'm just going to say S for Skype. Now you're going to go back to the application tab and you're going to see right here Skype and it has my Skype ID. So you want to do is click on your Skype ID name. So all this is all good. Click OK. So now you're going to have your Skype and your Star and the game. I have Star Wars right now going to be recording. So what I want to do is I want to have the game on top on the first. You want to have that on the very top. So what I do is I right click on Star Wars. I go to order. And I say move up. So now Star Wars should be the first thing to show up. Now here's the thing what I've seen other people do. This is my method, but I've seen other people do so many different things. This is the, what, the method that I use normally do. As I click on the Skype, so that would be Skype right there, that's the S. I'm going to go to Edit Scene. What I'm going to do is I'm going to shrink it. Shrink Skype. So this is the box right here. This is going to show Skype. 
So what I do is I just move it off so it's not in the display. And I always just do this. I usually make it as small as I can. Just get it out of there. Get it out of the uh, the picture because you never know. Something could happen and Skype could pop up while you're recording a game. So what I do is I just like to keep it off to the side. Yeah, smooth it as small as you can and just leave it off to the side. So now once that's all done, you're pretty you're pretty much all good. You know, you're all good to set. You know, Star Wars is gonna be for me is gonna be broadcasting. Right now you're not seeing that. You're just seeing the uh, you're seeing the monitor capture. But if I go, let's see what I can do here. I am going to go to monitor capture and go to edit. If I edit on the monitor capture, this is what I would be doing. You guys wouldn't be doing this. It, you could see it's still going blank. So this is just what I'm seeing for this video purposes. So if I go to Star Wars and I click on edit, you want to make sure the Star Wars is filling up the entire screen. The game, whichever game you're, you're recording, make sure that fills up the entire screen. And then make sure for Skype it's off to the side so it's not even on the display. And you should be all set to go. Uh, you, you just have to make sure, mess around with your audio settings as well as your own microphone. I've had to adjust this. Sometimes what you want to do is go to, you know, tell your friends, oh, we're going to record a game. But just do a pre-practice. Make sure all the audio levels are set. Make your friends or whoever you're talking to on Skype say a few couple of uh, sentences and then re play it over again. If you don't know where exactly it is, you could go, like, where your video is going to be saved. You could just go to settings and find where exactly the recordings are. But that should be it. That's the method that I do and what's best for me on recording my Skype audio, uh, Skype's, my friend's Skype as well, their audio coming through, as well as the game audio. So you just have to mess around with the audio around, you know, what you're going to do here with your mic and then the game audio mic. Because what I've noticed is that your Skype, uh, your Skype conversation, if you're talking to a friend, and the game audio is going to come through this. So you, when you lower this, it's going to lower your friend's uh, Skype conversation as well as the game so you got to be careful man that's why I usually do is I mess with the Skype audio on the Skype application like I showed you before so that's pretty much it just wanted to show you guys I usually normally don't do this I'm gonna show a quick preview of how everything syncs up and how it kinda works and give you a quick example my video right now for what I'm gonna show you is not out so I'm just gonna give you a quick snip of it alright guys not going to do this much often. I'm probably just going to do gaming audio. Just wanted to show everybody my method of how I record Skype audio as well as game audio and my voice as well. All right, guys. Thank you so much. Enjoy this quick example and peace What's out. What's going on, everybody? My name is Brian, and we all got some Star Wars Battlefront co-op Walker Assault with my buddy James. Say hi, James. Hey, what's up, guys? There you are. Heavy, They're sniping. Yeah, I'm gonna hit to the right up link. They have the AT. They have the AT. AT. Orbital strike. Orbital strike. Save that. Saving. I'm saving that for later. Yo, these Tie Fighters are shooting at infantry too. So yeah, they got a lot of Tie Fighters out there. Yeah, that, yeah they got the air for sure. I don't even see one. Uh, see alien. what we do. Try to get this down ASAP. Really? How did that even make sense? Oh boy, Boba Fett, Boba Fett, Boba Fett. Ah, uh, shit. Oh, I smacked Ooh. him in the back of the face. That was close. I think Boba, I think somebody got Boba Fett. Good melee, guys. That was a team melee. Yeah. That was fantastic. 